Hello viewers, welcome once again to our channel and uh, once again we are seeing the peas varieties and um, with me here are two varieties, we have variety A, so that's um, variety A and then uh, I have that one variety B, uh, this is what we call Kanyua and this is what we call Ganatho. Um, the two are good productive, they are short varieties, you can uh, if it's a, a skilled person or an experienced person to separate the two from the field. Um, this field is, is made more of uh, Kanya than Kanato. And uh, when I'm talking of the two varieties are local names, and um, both are short varieties, you can call them Grano, that's the trade name in the market. And um, you can also check on the previous video I had made on on uh, on uh, on peace varieties. So so this farm is majorly it has a lot of um, a lot of canoa. This is how we can they, put, they portray. This is a uh, canoa. So uh, that's it. That's how it is in there. That's it. They are long long and thin so they are long and thin and um, uh, the Tanato one maybe I can check around because most of it in this place is uh, is Kanyua that variety called Kanyua um, so it is uh, they are long I'm talking of Kanyua they are long and um, the long and thin, but the the another one. So this one, this one, this one, this one. You see, it is thick, it is thick and short. This is the another. So for Kanyua, it is long and um, long but thin. And also, one thing with Kanyua, uh, it has a lot of seeds inside. So. There's a big bit of difference. Um, maybe I can just uh, mention them in, in numbers. So for Kanyua, number one, it is long. Number two, it is a uh, thin shape. Number three, um, it has a lot of seeds inside. Number four, um, it has one challenge. It is uh, it takes it's it's hard to peel. Um, the pods are a bit uh, hard, so peeling is a bit hard. Number four, because of the hardiness of the pod, of the of the pod cover, um, it is tend to be high resistant to diseases. So you will find when you are taking them to the when you are taking them to the market, you will find can you remain to be greener than the other. Um, so this area, all this point, this place is a bit more of Kanyua. But now let, let me take you to this other field, the adjacent. It contains, it has a tanata. So um, on my this side it is Kanyua, and on this side it is a tanata. Uh, unfortunately, this tanata has not grown very well. It was not well tended. Um, so I'm just going to look for an area which is good, which is good, maybe I can check as I move along. Um, there was a lot of weeds here, so we actually took time before we came to, to work on it, so, uh, but um, it's picking up, at the end of the day we'll get something. Um, at least we'll expect me some. So you can see even the pods, they're big, eh? They're big. The pods are big. Uh, that makes a big difference. Pods are big. It's easy to peel, eh? What do you call peeling it? Or, you know, um, you know, removing the seeds. Um, that's it. So this is the natto. This is a kind one. You can see they are small, small size. 
can see how they are. They are small sized and long, you can see. And, and this is full, and it has written. This has written. But for the numbers, you know, just to ensure that I give you the difference. For the nasal, um, you can see how the bolts are. It is one bolt of the nasal. Eh? The big, the big size. The big size. So, that's it. Um, so, I've said for, know, for the nasal now, um, they are big size, they have big seeds. Easy to, to unwrap the pods. And then the unfortunate part is that they are highly susceptible to diseases compared to Kanyo. So when it is rainy, they tend to have black color. So they have black coating because you know they're affected by rain. So like this one, uh, like this one, you see, they are black color. So um, when it's in bucket, they are not appealing. They are not appealing when you are they are selling them. They are not appealing. You know, they, they, those two. You can see now this one is it, um, they have ripened, but they have maintained the they have maintained the green color. You can see they have maintained the green color. But for 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 the nut when they ripe, you know, they have. Um, uh, much rainfall, uh, they tend to change the. They actually are, they are really affected. They are highly susceptible to any form of disease. Eh? So, you see, it's not even yet ripe, but uh, well, this is the nato. But already you can see some patches of uh, of uh, of, uh, of diseases. Um, th there is another another variety which you can also check on my other. YouTube, uh, another work I did. Uh, this is this is the nato. You see how big they are. They are big, eh? but now you can see the patches. There's another one called Gigodoro. Gigodoro is bigger than uh, the fruit or the pod is bigger than the nato. Now um, the fruits are small, so the market is not 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 good because now you know have big pod, but what is being eaten is small, so at the end of the day, it's not, it's not, it cannot fetch good money. So this is Gigodoro. Uh, this is a variety I was uh, talking about. And um, as you can see, the pots are giant. Eh? You can see the pots are really giant. Eh? Big, big sized pots. Um, it's actually, the biggest, I can say, the biggest type of uh, piece um, has biggest pods. You can see. Um, though the, the the unfortunate part, maybe I can plug it. Uh, not allowed, but uh, you know, just accepted for educational purpose. We just have to do this, so you can see see the size eh? uh, it's, it's actually very very big very big very big eh? and the pods the, the seeds inside you can see they are actually smaller and uh, they are few for um, this is Gigodoro now for the canyon for the canyon this is canyon uh, you can see it is small um, this, I can place the two so you can see the other one is giant, the other one is small and then um, in the middle now is where we have the nato and then the, the one thing with the nato you know it, it's easy to 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 shell it eh? is it shelling? yeah to shell it that's why when you take the market you end up uh, getting good money you end up getting or fetching uh, you know it's 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 easily uh, those who purchase uh, like uh, the 
they like the nuts because it can easily be sold. So you can see this is now uh, this is now the nuts. So maybe I can place them. I can place them. Uh, I can fetch another one. This is a uh, stanato. Stanato. So I just want to get now a good picture of the Rico the Kanyua. So this is Kanyo. Um, so, so, so when you are, when you take the three to the market, they, they have different values. So the Gigodoro one, the Gigodoro one, the bigger one, unless there is no piece in the market, so they will take this one. Or maybe for Kenny, they will still take this one. Tanatho, Tanatho, Tanatho is actually the best one in the market. So, uh, the buyers love Tanatho because it's easily, you can uh, remove the seeds easily. But for Kanyua, this is Kanyua. For Kanyua, peeling it, the cover is harder. Though, though it has, um, you know, it's not affected by the rain, so it's hardy. You know, they reach the market being greener than Tanato, or they have good weights. But you know, um, the, the person or the people have a job shelling it. They want something can quickly do it for, for them to cook. So, and uh, one thing, the nut is a bit, a bit uh, sweeter, easy to write. Yeah, those are very good factor. It writes faster than, uh, it writes faster than Kanyua and uh, Anato. And fast, sorry, it writes faster. Anato writes when it is being cooked faster than Kanyua. Or any other variety. So in 15 minutes, yeah, 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 good. So this one, unless someone is buying pots, the the Godoro one, eh? unless someone is interested in pots, then uh, you can purchase this. But you know, most people, you know, we they are interested in the seeds. Eh? So this one is just heavy. You know, Godoro is heavy because of the pot. But at the end of the day, what you have is a little. So that's what it is. That's uh, how it contains. This is a, a classic example of uh, Katanato. Um, yes, Katanato is a classic example of Kaino. Um, I'm actually trying to differentiate the two because um, not everyone can identify easily. Or can separate easily unless uh, you see Kanyo. This Kanyo. Kanyo is a bit long, yeah, it's a bit long, but uh, the cover is a bit hard. Uh, it's compared to Sanato. Uh, that's it. When you're also planning to plant, uh, you know, I, I only know one place in Kenya where they, they like uh, Kanyo, but everyone else is. Uh, Taking Tanato. Everyone else like Tanato. That's it. So this is Kanyua. This is Kanyua. So you can see how Tanato is uh, thicker. You, you, you might think uh, the other one is fed with nitrogen, I mean uh, fertilizer, and the other, no, not that way. Even Tanato, even, even Kanyua, if he's right. They still maintain that slender, the slender, the slim shape. So you can see, you can see how it is. Uh, it's long, it's long, but uh, you know it's not thick. But when it comes to Kanato, you see, it's thick, eh? It's thick. And uh, that's it. Uh, thank you for watching. Hope you learned something. Remember to subscribe share like um, for more videos hit also that notification bell when uh, i do something else you can is
easily easily get the information. Thank you. Uh, meet you in the next video.